the Bitcoin super cycle has now begun. Guys, I did a crazy ass video from you, but I just didn't get any time to post it for you yesterday. It was a short handled video, it was really cool. Um, but anyways, congratulations to Donald Trump for winning the presidential US elections. That is absolutely amazing as per prediction on our channel. As we did say, we don't know, but we presume that he would be winning because of a number of metrics. If you guys wanted to go and watch that, you would have seen all of that on my live streams that I've been sharing with you. You would have seen that on anything that I've been sharing with you. Now that that main event is done and gone past, what is next for Bitcoin and crypto? Well, my friends, if you've been watching and watch my channel and subscribe to my channel, I've been hitting you with meme coins. I've been hitting you with free coins to mine on your cell phones um, like these two here. I've been talking about coins you can invest in. I've been talking about Bitcoin breaking. I've been talking about 1000 X's becoming a billionaire millionaire. I guess the choice is yours. And it's also depending on how much liquidity and dry powder you have to enter this space here right now. Now, if you have not been subscribed to my channel, watching my videos for a number of months or years now, because I've been around for about five years, my friends, I don't know what you're doing, but now is the last moment and I'm going to show you why. Beyond this point, I would not invest in anything else, particularly other than Bitcoin. Okay, my bags are full, so I hope yours are too. If you are here and have been here with me for some time, make some noise because you're early, my friend. And right now, as Bitcoin has broken out of this all-time high, literally and closed up right above you look at that resistance level that we've been talking about here that we had horizontal resistance it closed above that it had um upward sloping resistance it closed above that and that's just a stochastic getting going my friends we're about to we're going to chill here for this day here tomorrow's friday i expect us to make another candle to the upside i would say we could possibly be in the cards for like 80k 75 i mean we're at 75k already we already went up to 60 76 thousand five hundred and eighty dollars well that's on this exchange kraken um on the others is like 76 380 odd so it's like 300 dollars difference here and there it depends on the exchange now my friends let's delve right into the news so that we can have some fun on this video it's going to be a very very quick video so let's go in today I would appreciate if you shared the love on my Twitter page, my X page, Crypto Bliss KD, Kiara DeCast, just like this Crypto Bliss, as you can see. And um, yeah, I've been pumping things out here for you. So I really hope you enjoy this. I've got a lot of energy here. So make sure to subscribe. Anyways, Anyways let's delve right in. Because according to Michael Saylor, Michael Saylor will be, well, he is favoriting and sharing that they have as america a new bitcoin president amazing all right donald trump is that because we've explained that a few times on the channel so i'm not going to go into that at this point in this video but michael saylor wishes to make washington the bitcoin capital of the world let's do this well done to america because this serves people in crypto my friend and crypto and cryptography are the way of the future for business okay so if you aren't building a business in crypto and web3 and looking at potentially uh buying bitcoin to add to your company as a reserve fund to use to benefit and to protect its future against inflation to buy more products so that your business stays open my friends i don't know what you're doing there you need to get some bitcoin now, the next step for Bitcoin is definitely an even more freight. Well, actually, it's discovery, price discovery, because we've created the new all time high now. So, seven months of chop solidation has done its job, moving coins into stronger hands and cooling off the initial ETF hype. So, the one thing I do want to point out here is that this is the Bitcoin euphoria zone. 2016, when Trump was initiated as president, boom, look at this pump here. New all time highs discovery. But we were around this level here, okay? We were way down in the cool off here in the MVRV score. Now, this at the Biden point, look how the Biden one was so heavily suppressed here. And if we look at where Biden's one came in, it was over 
extended already. Here, we're still chilling hard. Look at how pump, uh, Trump likes to pump Bitcoin. Now, this is already eight years ago that Trump was speaking, like kind of, you know, me may, he's the reason that Bitcoin pumped at that moment because of the amount of money that he printed. Imagine what he's going to do this round for us and how he's going to help Bitcoin pump. Because all he has to do is print more dollars so that Bitcoin goes up in its value and therefore they hold more, they can buy more Bitcoin, making their dollars more secure. This is fortuitous to the American and US government and economy. So I dig that. All right. Now, as you can see here, the new all time high exactly matches the 2021 cycle. Early bull market is from here to here, basically. And then from this black dotted line, um, and right now we're at the red, we're at the red line, we literally see. So sometimes we had a pullback, sometimes we had a pullback before we got to this line. So let, let it unfold. It doesn't matter if it goes up or not or down right now. You can see inevitably that we are going to climb the mountain. Okay, the mountain being Bitcoin as the mountain and this yellow one was the Trump one. This orange one was the bottom one. So look what Trump is going to do for Bitcoin, my friend. 2024. 2024. Look how many new all-time highs we hit here. Look how many new all-time highs we hit with, with Trump. My friends, we've got a beautiful journey ahead of us. And um, according to Bitcoin, approaching two-week upper Bollinger Band, while bands are the tightest in history, according to BB Width, expect fireworks above 75k. I uh, do expect so too. And the reason for that is, is that the Bollinger Width down here is the most overextended it has ever been since uh, Trump, actually. Because there was Biden, boom, and there was Trump, boom. And here is Trump once again. So my friends, like I've been saying to you, I believe that we will see an incredible combination in this cycle of the 2013 to 2017 cycle, not the 2020 cycle, because this was way suppressed. So I'm not so convinced on diminishing returns, especially with all the bullishness going on around elections, Bitcoin president being election, economics doing his best to make Bitcoin and crypto flourish, um, the world buying Bitcoin, the ETFs launched, uh, institutions, all kinds of things, my friend. I, I just, I don't see Bitcoin like doing this. I see Bitcoin doing this or even 2013, like, like a Superman flying into the sky. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. But as we move on, it is it is it finally here? And this is why I said altcoin season is around the corner. Every single time there has been a presidential election, boom, boom, and boom. Here, yes, we made one more one more month of kind of upside, but then immediately it revolved and reversed down into the altcoin season the same here altcoin season altcoin season we are getting ready like we're up actually up here at like 62 and a half percent at the moment 62 percent odd already so we're actually very much up here which means that we're very overextended it is it time to see us pull down for altcoin season let me know what you think i've been sharing that with you for some time that it is so my friends, Bitcoin two month RSI is over 70. Boom, it is time. Every single time it went above 70. Boom, okay. 70, boom, 70, boom, 70, boom. I'm pretty confident we're gonna do something like this. Boom, boom, something like that is what I keep saying to you guys. So I don't know, what do you think? Let me know down below, please, my friend. The three phases of Bitcoin, the first leg up, boom, the reaccumulation, boom, and then the price discovery, boom, first leg up, reaccumulation, and price discovery. Could we be going to see the 300k target that I have been saying that we will hit? My friend, look how far we are away. Would you like to see what percentile that is from where we are? That's 300%, my friend. Ah, 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 ah. 
And even if we only came up to here at the 242 odd, that is still a whopping 213%. My friend, we have very, very, very beautiful journey ahead of us in price discovery now, creating new all-time highs along the way. Now, here's the thing. Is Bitcoin is going to 250k post-election. 2016, pumped by 2747% post-election. 2020, BTC pumped 360% post-election. And 2024, with a Bitcoin uh, pro-Bitcoin president, even a 240% pump would mean 250k per, go per Bitcoin. Look here. 240% would take us right now up to 250 grand. Bitcoin. I'm pretty confident you see where we're going at right now. Like, there's the diminishing returns that Mags is really speaking about here. But the truth is, is does it go only to 240, 50,000, 300,000? We'll have to wait and see, won't we? Now, this is the most bullish and one of the most exponentially reliable indicators that are on uh, on chain indicators. And every time the hash ribbon prints a buy signal, we have witnessed a nice jump in BTC's price shortly after. A few months ago, the hash ribbon printed another buy signal, yet BTC has been trading sideways without much movement. If the trend repeats, we could soon see BTC make a strong up move. So there was the buy signal that happened there, which was pretty much over there. Every time it made a buy signal, prior to that, it has literally pumped right up, my friends. Right up. The hash ribbons are only but increasing on crypto, on Bitcoin. The only time they decrease is in a capitulation phase. That is it. Other than that, the hash rooms just keep going up, which means that Bitcoin's price continues to go up, 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 up. That's all it's gonna do. So I know that as you see here, Bitcoin is tracking the 2017 and 21 bull market perfectly and is ready for liftoff. Look at that. Look at that. We're at this phase. We literally are at this phase. Boom. Boom. I don't know. What do you think we're going to see here? According to this, and if we do hit diminishing returns, say we even did this, we did a 10x, my friends. That will give us a 750 thousand dollar fucking price on Bitcoin. I don't know what you think it's going to hit, my friend. But let's go and see what some of the most infamous people on Twitter, X, YouTube are predicting and out there in the economic world are predicting that we hit this cycle in crypto, in Bitcoin specifically. So according to Mark Yusko, in 2025, it'll hit 150k. According to Peter Brunt, in September 25, it'll hit 135k. According to Tim Draper, 250k. According to Robert Kiyosaki, 500k by 2025. Wow. I've been showing you the rainbow chart that shows us about a 500k 2020 chart. Now, it's interesting how this chart is laid out, right? Because this is essentially where we're going over the next little while. Okay. Arthur Hayes predicts by 2026 that we will have a $750,000 Bitcoin. My friends, that's your 10X that we just spoke about right here on the chart by 2026. Okay. That's one year away, pretty much 12 to 13 months away. Now, my uh, plan B predicts 400K by 2026. Mark Novogratz predicts 500k by 2028. Okay, so him and Robert Kiyosaki, but they're like three years difference out. Kathy Wood predicts a million dollars by 2030. Boom, up there. Tyler Winkelvass predicts 500k by 2030. Okay. So I, I don't know. I, I don't quite agree with Tyler Winkelvass. I, I agree more in the Robert Kiyosaki and Arthur Hayes zone is my actual target um well i said to you 300 but really i said to you that we could punch right through like 450 550 even up to 
700 odd K. So it is possible. And here is the, the beast of them all. Michael Saylor says by um, 2045, we will have a $13 million Bitcoin. If we have a $13 million Bitcoin, my friend, and you own one Bitcoin today, and today Bitcoin is currently sitting at approximately 75,000. You do the math for yourself, my friend. Those are massive gains, massive, massive gains. Okay, you become a millionaire like this over, or well, not overnight, over a quarter of 20 year period. That's that's pretty decent, man. Pretty decent. You become a decamillionaire alone. Now, as you can see here, you can use my Bybit link down below. Get yourself up to $30,000 deposit bonus. I would not be surprised if we had a pullback to retest here, okay, the breakout level. I would not be surprised. If we do have a pullback, that, my friend, will be your last opportunity to enter into a trade using my link down below. That is going to be my personal level. And I'm going to add in right here, okay, at 71, 70, yeah, 72,000 will be my buy entry on this trade right there. 70, 72,500. That will be my buy entry on a trade. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, show some love, show some love. Share the video with your friends, my friend. Lots of love, and we'll see you on the next one. Stay blessed and get yourself some free money here, man. It's free. Get it. It's free. It doesn't do anything. It doesn't use your data or anything. For free. And it's going to make you lots of money. Financially free, let alone everything that you're doing with Bitcoin. Lots of love. We'll see you on the next one.